the sheep that belong to me listen to my voice we heard the same gospel last sunday the shepherd and his voice how to be listen to the voice of god amidst all the all kinds of noises around us even within us lot of noise is within us and around us around us how do we how can we listen to the voice of god listening to the voice of god is called in simple terms prayer prayer is all about listening to the voice of god how is your prayer life like it's all mostly about giving directions to god telling him what he already knows or complains our grumblings our sorrows everything is okay we can bring everything to the lord a prayer is primarily or should be i should say it should be listening to god just to listening just to listening of course you can maybe ask a footnote to all your list. at the end you can say something you need but primarily it is listening to god who is the best example our lady herself learn from our lady devotion to our lady but learn from her what kind of prayer life she had luke has got gives us a good clue about Mary's prayer life. Mary pondered on all these things. Pondering is prayer. What do you do when you ponder? You have got something that, is, that makes sense? Or God's promises have come true? And on the other side, you find God's promises having to come true. your prayer has not been answered so you have got on the one hand a prayer answered promises fulfilled god the word of the lord came true on the other hand it hasn't happened things are going the wrong way and you have got both in both your hands and you ponder you look at both and you ponder you look at both and you ponder and you have a silence in the silence is the revelation in the silence when you what you understand what you can't understand you both have it together in that moment you are like lord i can't understand you this makes sense this doesn't you have spoken it came true you have spoken it hasn't come true these two in front of me what shall i do lord you speak every time you give time for silence you will find God has something to say to you.